Hey everyone, my name is Brittany Thies. You can find me on Twitter at Bubba Brit Thies or on Instagram at Bubba Brit Thies. Or you can follow me on Facebook at Brittany Thies. Or if you want some really weird Snapchats, follow me at Brit Thies. I'm going to tell you about some of the things I have learned through the University of Regina and their ECNI 831 course. The course was led by our great leaders, Alec and Katya. Follow them on Twitter here. If there's one thing I've learned in this class is that through connectivism, we can learn anything and almost everything using the powers of the great and magnificent internet. In this class, we found that we could connect with some super famous people other than Wayne Manteca. Speaking of getting connected, our class formed our own community using Google+. This was our community forum where we always had each other's backs. We uncomfortably got comfortable with one another by taking brutal lighting selfies with Padlet and getting our Buck Martinez on by tape recording responses on Flipgrid. By the second class, we pulled our lives together through social media management systems and PLEs like TweetDeck, Hootsuite, Feedly, and Symbaloo. What did I do without these tools in my life before this class? We used Zoom to connect in real time and learned about other live streaming technologies such as Meerkat, Periscope, or Bamboozer. Whether we liked it or not, we were thrown into the world of blogging. Most of us use WordPress as a way to creatively connect to the world. We were given the ability to have our own thoughts expressed in our own ways. I channeled my inner Baba and made a blog about living a simplified and more enjoyable life through the traditions of my grandmothers. On our blogs, we were to place widgets. Pretty sure I connected every widget known to man. Widgets like Goodreads and Pinterest were added to my blog. People like Clive Thompson taught us how even brutal bloggers like me may be helping to spark ideas around the world. Thanks, Clive. There's always hope. Alec continually reminded us to ponder the idea of buying our very own domains. This lesson still has not been internalized and probably never will, since I'm so damn cheap when it comes to spending money. Sorry, Alec. Katya was always an advocate of comfight.com but I'll probably continue using Google Images until I get sued or put in jail. By the way, all the images used today are from Google Images. Thanks, Google! Through the use of memes in memegenerator.com, we created messages that made us laugh out loud. Uh -uh -uh. We learned that we could pretty much learn anything for free using youtube.com or massive open online courses like Coursera. We also learned that sharing is caring through organizations like Creative Commons, that strives to expand creativity throughout the world. We continued connecting with the world by hashtagging the shit out of anything and everything. Social media accounts blew up, whether this was through Instagram, Facebook, or Twitter. We also learned to Snapchat like teenagers. I'm so glad many of you were using your digital citizenship minds while using Snapchat. Good job, team! We learned that we could even connect with people we didn't know in our immediate area. No, I don't mean Tinder for all you lovers out there. I mean Yik Yak. John Oliver, my new crush, informed us about the dark side of the internet. The dark side includes trolls and 4chan. Don't be fooled by those smiles and that Kylie Jenner hair. They are both your real and virtual worst nightmare. Finally, we were taught that slacktivism is activism. So click away and raise awareness for your cause. Always remember, we are changing the world and connecting with it. One click at a time. Well, that's it, folks. Thanks for listening. And I hope you enjoyed this semester as much as I have. If you want to connect with me, follow me on these sites. Thanks. Bye.